What's up guys, Kino here today and today I'm going to help you fix a problem that maybe some of you are going to run into when you try to root your phone. So I'm going to explain to you what happened to me. I installed Odin, I have a Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge, did the stuff that I'm supposed to do and then I came up with the boot screen saying recovery is not C Android Droid or C Android enforced that and then it would just freeze or it would not go any further so I guess um, the problem is that your phone the Samsung Galaxy S6, the Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge and Note 4 and all those new Samsung smartphones um, they have Knox. Now Knox is a security system developed by Samsung to like keep keep your device safe also it's for Samsung Pay when um, you can't play put fake money in or do stuff like that. That is why there is Knox. Now when you root your phone, the uh, Knox will say no, you can't do that. Um you can't change your phone setting. So the problem is so then it run and now my phone got freeze. Sadly I cannot show you what happened since I already tried this out and it worked. I can't go back in the same situation. But I can show you how to fix this problem simply and effective. So, what you guys have to do is just install Samsung Keys 3. I'm going to put this in the link description below, and all you guys have to do is download that. And it's a Samsung app, and it's like iTunes, similar type, and that's all you guys have to do. Next, um, you're going to have to open Samsung Keys. Will take a while. Sorry. Samsung Keys 3 opened up. Next thing you guys have to do is go to Tools and go on Firmware Upgrade and Installation. And what this will do is just put back on the software and just do the stuff that you need um, for your new phone or for the thing. One warning, always to remember, guys, is that. When you do this, your phone, everything that's in there gets deleted. Yes, that's the problem. I This is the only way I can fix it. This is the only way I know how to fix because I did some research. This is the only way I found how to do it. Yes, it's sad because I lost my pictures, I lost my songs, I lost everything that I had on my phone, which is kind of sad. But I guess I just have to suck it up because it's better to have the phone working back than losing pictures because I need my phone and I can't live without it. So when you guys have that, the f when you just click on that, and now you're going to do the model name. Just type in your model name from your for your phone. Just click do something. So in my case, I'm actually going to do like um. Just it's gonna it's I'm, I I don't know my mom model number right now, so I'm, I can't type that in. But model name it's going to ask your serial number your serial number is on your back of your phone it should be if not check your box if not there I don't know what else just try to get it somehow because you can't open your phone then just hit OK after you're um, putting in the serial number and the model name is already there just hit OK the next thing you have to do is go on your phone and your phone just press your home button the volume down and the power off all together at the same time until it comes to this download screen where it says where you use for Odin download where you get, can just like it's just blue and it's where you can choose if you want to restart the device like just go back to normal or you want to go to download mode so go press um, volume up so that's going to go to download mode and then plug in your phone to the computer hit install and your phone will start rebooting and you should be back and it's just like it totally just like wiped out your phone put the software back in and that would do so guys I really hope this helped and um, if you guys have any questions just comment down below I'll try my best that I can reply to you guys and um, yeah also, um, it would be great help if you guys could like this video and subscribe to this channel. Since I am new, I just want to get started and my goal is to help you guys. Now, 
one short thing is that um, I am actually on a way to find out if you actually root your Samsung Galaxy S6 with Knox. And the thing is, there is an app called Ping Pong Root. Ping Pong Root will actually kind of bypass the um, Knox security, so and you'll just you can't just use Samsung Pay, and you'll just you'll just have still have root. For unfortunately, it doesn't work on my phone, so I can't show you it. So if I when soon when the update is done and when Ping Pong Root updates itself, um it will soon be able to support my phone and then I will show you guys how to do that so guys I hope you guys enjoyed it um, hope this was a help and I'll see you soon